It's time for Holy Baloney, the game show where you gotta guess who is telling the truth and who's full of baloney. He's so peace that he went for once! Now, let's meet today's contestants. First up, we have Strawberry Shake. That's me. She's a fifth grade soccer star who wants to be a ghost hunter when she grows up. Our second contestant is Vanilla Shake. Yeah. He's a fourth grader who loves supreme scootering and salsa dancing. Okay, kids, it's time to play. Which of these sharp-witted shakes is telling the truth to this question? Why do we shake hands? Oh. I know why people shake hands. People started shaking hands a long time ago to see if you were a good or a bad person. People believed that other people had good and bad spirits inside of them. And the only way to find out was by shaking someone's hand. If their hand was warm, they were thought to be safe and healthy. If their hand was cold, they were rather to be sick or not to be trusted. Even though we know that's not true, we still shake hands today, just because of tradition. Unless you're sick or something, you don't want to spread germs. Okay, so you're saying people started shaking hands to see if someone was good or evil. Could be true, but we still gotta hear from Vanilla Shake. Vanilla Shake, why do you think we shake hands? Well, back in the olden days when there were wars and battles all the time, people shook hands as a sign of peace. If you came across a strange who was swinging a sword around like some medieval ninja, you might have thought they were going to attack you. So. If that person meant you no harm, they'll put their weapon away and show you their empty hand. And you would show them your empty hand. And then you'd shake hands as a sign of peace. Basically, people do it today because we did it back then. So kids, can you guess who told the truth? Was it Strawberry Shake with her story about detecting evildoers? Or was it Vanilla Shake with his story about the peace offering? You guess the story about the sign of peace? Well, you're right! And did you know the high five was supposedly invented by a baseball player? Well, goodbye, au revoir, and peace. Did somebody say ping? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>